Hey everybody, Aaron Blaze here, and I got something really cool to show you. Look at this animation. First of all, there's about 190 drawings here, and I just want to flip through here and show you this draw animation. I did this about 25 years ago, and this is early animation that I did of Yao from Mulan. And this is his what his character looked like early on. And I did this test animation, and we just found it going through some boxes. And I thought it'd be really fun to kind of pull it out, show you what it takes to do this, just the, the sheer volume of drawings. But then I thought we could sit down, start shooting it, and I can play it back for you in real time, and you can see what the results are. So uh, why don't we jump to it? Okay, so we've gotten set up. I've got my camera and uh, my down shooter, and I'm shooting through Dragon Frame software. And so all of this goes through into my computer. I go one drawing at a time. I know the exposures for each drawing. And so I just come in here and click. And click. And we just slowly go through all of my drawings. I've got, like I said, I've got about 100 and 150 drawings, I think, in here for this shot. Somewhere around there. And uh, it just takes time to go through and shoot them all. This is how we used to do it old school. Once we got all the drawings done, then we'd come through and shoot them all. We all had down shooters in our offices. And so, um, you know, there's about 35 animators. A lot of uh, off, uh, animators shared offices. So we probably had about 15 or 20 down shooters spread out amongst all the animators. And so when we would finish a shot and we wanted to see how it played, we'd have to take the time to sit down and start shooting like this. And then we'd have to time everything out and play it back and see how it worked. If it didn't work, we'd have to go back to the drawing board and so to speak and uh, start drawing again. But if we liked it, then we would set up a meeting with the directors go sit with the directors and uh, we would show them the shot. And if they liked it, it would get cut into the movie and we would move on and go to the next shot. Now, obviously you can see that these are somewhat rough drawings and they're not in color. Well, the process would be if they got approved, then it would move on to the cleanup department who would go through and actually take every single one of these drawings that you see and redraw them to make them nice and clean and pretty and then those are the drawings that would get scanned and brought into the computer and colored. And those, so that's how you got color on, uh, on, the, on the screen. And so anyway, it's a long process. It's a lot of labor, but it's a labor of love. We love doing this. I love the old you know, technique of, of animation being drawing and, and being hand done, you know, something that there's no keyboards involved. It's, it's literally right from the fingers. And um, what I always love about this technique is that if you can imagine it, and it's you know with CG as well, but if you can imagine it, you can do it. And what I love about hand-drawn animation is if you can imagine it, you can just sit down and draw it right away, and it's right there. And there's so many times that we've done that. But I'm going to go ahead and finish this up, and then we'll jump over to the computer, and we'll time it all out and uh, we'll see how it looks. Okay, so I've got all my drawings over here and you can see as I click through, you can see the drawings move, which is really cool. And then uh, within Dragon Frame, I have the ability to go through and change timing and play with all that. I've got all my timing set. So now it's just a matter of playing it back and seeing how it looks. So let's go ahead and do that. So, so it looks pretty good. So I'm going to go ahead and add some sound and let's see how it looks. Huh? Uh. 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 Uh.
<laughs> okay, so there you have it. There is a, a little slice of history right there. Once again, here's the drawings for that one character, Yao. Uh, it was kind of a, you know, he was a secondary character in the film. But, you know, we put so much work into everything that we do on these films. And, um, and this is just one of literally thousands of shots that would have been animated for the movie. And um, it, you end up literally with a mountain of paper, a mountain of, of, of information, um, millions of drawings. And, uh, but it was, like I said, it was such a labor of love and so much fun to do. I've got even more stuff that I'm going to be pulling out and showing you guys. And I'm really excited to show you, but I hope you enjoyed that. And I'll talk to you next time. Thanks.